Well, that court hearing was very brief. It only lasted a few minutes or so, really, but it was certainly a very emotional hearing here. We saw Ryan Huber's family there, uh, or excuse me, Ryan Poston's family there, among others, who were just kind of holding each other and crying as they filed in. This hearing, though, is postponed for about two months because of technical issues. Now, Poston's family members filed in, holding each other and at times wiping away tears. This hearing comes after Shana Huber's attorneys filed a motion for a new trial this year. Her attorneys claim a juror in her case was a convicted felon and should have never been there. Now, Hubers was convicted of murder last year. Jurors recommended she spend about 40 years in prison. Hubers shot to death her ex-boyfriend, Ryan Poston, in 2012. Now, in court, Hubers appeared upbeat, turning back to the crowd in court and smiling and applying chapstick and fixing her hair. After the hearing, Poston's family members told us they will fight the court battle again. We're going to move forward until it's resolved. We're okay with that. We're going to resolve it. Justice so. will be served. Yep. We are convinced. Now, the judge did not make any ruling today. However, the hearing is reset for mid-August. Of course, we'll keep following this story for any new developments. For now, we're live in Newport tonight. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5. All right, Dan, and you can read our complete coverage of the Huber's trial on our website.